There are a lot of unsupported claims and outright false information being circulated about the election. The 11 Alive team is working to bring you facts. A report posted on Gwinnett County's website continues to cause confusion. And here is a question that we have received from 11 Alive viewers. How could the website show 827,000 ballots were cast when there aren't that many registered voters in Gwinnett? We asked Caitlin Ross to verify. If you look on Gwinnett County's election website, it doesn't seem to make sense. There are 581,000 registered voters in the county. 416,458 people voted, but 827,758 ballots were cast. What? Christine wrote to 11 Alive to ask about the math. Were there extra ballots cast in this election? We reached out to Joe Sorensen, the communications director for Gwinnett County, who first just told us that the number of ballots in the election summary doesn't reflect the number of ballots actually cast in the election. But why not? According to Sorensen, Gwinnett County is the only county in Georgia that has to comply with Section 203 of the Voting Rights Act. That's because according to census data, Gwinnett County reached the threshold of Spanish speakers that mandated ballots be sent in both English and Spanish, two pages. So for each ballot that the county sends out, there's not just one sheet, but two, one in English, one in Spanish. Some voters return just one sheet of paper, other voters return both. But either way, Sorensen says the county is mandated to include both sheets of paper in its election summary report. By federal law, Gwinnett County cannot remove that election summary section, even though Sorensen says he knows it creates confusion for voters. So we can verify that no, there were not extra ballots cast in the Gwinnett County election, but the county is mandated to report every sheet of paper it sends out to voters to comply with Section 203 of the Voting Rights Act. Gwinnett's election director told us while Gwinnett is the only Georgia county required to do this right now, a new census means that Hall County may start soon too.